things that I'm gonna do just to get a few YouTube views. Run up in the church like pew pew pew. Cause that's what I do. All right, Boogaloo crew, on this episode, on this shoe review, we have something that was limited to 23,000 pairs, something with extremely high resale, something that I really love because I love my black and red. You know, you know I love my black and red. I love the black and red. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead. We're going to roll the intro, and we're going to get off into it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before I roll the intro, in my description, in the description, I have a link to a second channel for me. It is not a new channel. I mean, it's a new channel, but it's not like something that I'm trying to like springboard off of this one. It's going to be the same premise, and it's just a backup safety channel. If they come clapping to get this channel down, I will have a backup. So I need everyone to follow me on Instagram. And to also subscribe to the new channel so I could just roll it on over. I'm going to be uploading all my old videos to that new channel. So whenever the time comes, I just flip the switch. Boom, all videos go live. All my subscribers are there. We don't miss a beat. And follow me on Instagram so y'all can have the word. So the word could be out. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to roll the intro. And we're going to get off into this extremely limited Hot review. Let's get it. shoe review all right y'all today i have a return seller foots kicks foots kick eight on instagram my girl winnie she sent me some <laughs> what she sent me something good and i'm excited about it it is an extremely limited drop i was excited to get this sent to me you know I like my black and red yeah so I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna get the cross the water alley-oop from Winnie and we're gonna get off into it so hey Winnie you can go ahead and you can send me that cross the water alley-oop I'm ready for it <laughs> Go. I know what you're thinking right now. Is that a fearless box? It's not the fearless box. It's a retro Jordan box. Right, right, right. The red and black one before it was black and red, you know? So here we got Nike branding along the box. The swoosh. We got the branding and legality on the back of the box all right i'm gonna go ahead and let y'all read the size and label all righty i'm gonna go ahead and read it we got an air jordan one high 85 style code bq4422600 varsity red black varsity red size eight my size is the reversed band y'all Winnie 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 thank you thank you Winnie thank you so let's open it up I don't have any stamp up here or anything like that just a regular top we got like some uh, paper 23. I think the retails have like the Wings logo and Jumpman and all this and that. But yeah, it's got the 23 on this. So I mean, the paper's wrong. So what? 
Alright, each shoe came wrapped in a bag. So we got one shoe, two shoe, red shoe, blue shoe. Alright, take the paper out and it has the little yum sticker down there. But that's it. No stock X, none of that. Don't need it. Don't need it. Alright. Take the shoe out of the bag. Each shoe. All right, we are going to do a quick 360 and then hop off into it. So here we go. Flip it, medial side, bottoms, bow, bow. All right, we're gonna set these down. We're gonna go over the bag. The bag is a nice material uh, dust bag. Um, they have one for each shoe. It has like a little drawstring on it. Put some metal aglets on the drawstring. All right. And on each bag, these were uh, 23,000 pair release, right? Okay, so each bag is number of the pair that you got retail. So you see right there, each bag has the same number on each bag. All right, so I got number 14,340 out of 23,000. Stunning like my daddy, stunning like my daddy, huh? Uh, but yeah, so nice bag, black with the red Nike Air on it. I dig it, I dig it. Let's get rid of the bags, drop it away. All right, let's hop off with the left shoe. They came with the old school retro card. Jordan over the Chicago skyline. Old school Jordan with the windsuit track pants on, warm up pants. And he got those red and black Jordan ones on. Check them out. Yep, all right. Back has the Nike logo on it. Here you go, take a look at the card. Pause it if you want, take a good peep at it. This is a authentic retro card that was on the Jordans back in the day. Got a nicely neat extra set of laces, black set, and it comes with the red set on it. All right, so what's the difference between this and the bands, all right. The difference is, on the bands, this was black, all right? Now up here by the uh, Wings logo was red. So this part where the laces are is red. But then up here is black, all down the rest of the lacing system was black, all right? The toe box was red on the bands. And then the mud guard was black along with this piece right here. The strap or whatever they called it was black. So everything else is the same as the bands. This quarter panel of the medial side and outside of the shoe still black. The swoosh still red around the uh, Achilles tendon and the heel still red. Um, the collar still black and then like I said with the around the wings wings logo and this flex strap still red. All right So that is that All right, it's like a stiffer, but It's like a smooth feeling leather. It feels really good in the hand um, It is stiffer 
but I mean it feels really really good the swoosh looks good the stitching and everything is on point Right. Look at the booty back pinch. This is on it with these, bro. They hit them. They hit these. Like for real. They hit it. Got the red bottom. Pop out stars. Like they hit these. All right. It's a black tongue with the red Nike Air on it. All right. We got the red Nike Air on the black insole. And then they have like these numbering system, like the bands had it too, all right? But the bands was like the date of the actual band. Um, I don't know if this is when production wrapped on the shoe. So 10, 27, 19, um, and it has size eight, your size, so 19, used to have like it used to be 85 and then something so it was the year 85 then the month and then the date so this is 19 10 27 so i don't know if it's the year 2019 10th month 27th day was when the uh production of these shoes wrapped but i mean that's the numbers that's stamped on the inside on the collar uh, let's see underneath is just the cardboard with the uh, laces stamped down. Um, this is uh, authentic height of the shoe. And you can see it's kind of straight back here. And it's just as high as the regular 1985 height on the Jordan 1s. All right, the retails did come stuff with paper. This one did not. Uh, see, size and tag is down in there. I'm gonna go ahead and read it. Got a size eight, my size. Style code BQ4422600. Manufactured dates was 8-21-19 to 10-23-19. And yeah, QC code, blah, 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 blah. It says XC, so there's an XC up here. And then, uh, yeah. So I think this is when uh, the production of the shoe actually wrapped, was 10, 27, 19. If I had to guess, bruh, and that's just my humble guess. So, yeah. All right, uh, nice thick tongue. So yeah, that's that one. Let's hop off into this one real quick. Be able to get a better up close ride. That's all I'm gonna do, it's just the same as that one. The booty back pinch is A-OK -okay on this one too. This is a well-made shoe. There we go, no sloppy glue. All the stitching is hitting. No mess up on the paint job. Got that all white midsole. Looking all so good. This is a good looking shoe, in my opinion. Like, I love it. Boy, I love it, bruh. What? Yeah, I'm down with them. I'm down. But yeah, that is them, bro. The high 85 Jordan 1 reverse bands. Oh, they smell good too, bro. But yeah, Foots Kick 8. My girl Winnie. She never disappoints. Never disappoints, bro. Every time she's good to go, she sends the heat. So. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna throw them on the turntable. I'm gonna throw them on feet. We're gonna wrap it up. Be right back.
right, Boogaloo crew wrapping up, y'all. We got the Jordan 1 High 85 reverse band thing. Varsity Red. Hey, bro. 10 out of 10. All the way. They messed up on the paper. Don't care. They messed up on the paper on the inside of the shoe. Don't care. They got the bags right. They got the shoe right. They got the construction right. They use some, I think, and even though it's like a stiffer and it's not tumbled leather, it's some soft feeling smooth leather. I love it. I love the colorway. Man, it's just a good looking shoe. Look at the wings. I didn't show the wings that good. Look at the wings. Looking good. Man, feel this. It's just a good shoe, bro. 10 out of 10, all the way. Winnie did it sending this she did it bro she is like top one or two seller toe box height is good like everything about the shoe is a1 a1 from day one i'm a rocker until the sole fall off like this is a permanent fixture in the rotation after the pandemic is over with hey, boogaloo crew your boy boogaloo we got foot kicks Foots kick eight on Instagram. Been at the corner of the screen. That's mine over there. If you hit Winnie up, bro, you can send her a DM. You can send me a DM. Guys, you, bro, I will help you out with these, bro. But yeah, good to go. 10 out of 10. Like, yeah. So my next shoe review is gonna be a Yeezy. Y'all stay tuned. It's from a really good seller, really good factory. Boom, but yeah, so I do have some more heat coming. I got heat coming from now until I don't even know when. Like, it ain't gonna stop. It's not gonna stop. Like, they back on and popping over there and they keeping me working, bro. And I don't mind it, bro. So, your boy Boogaloo, Boogaloo Crew, I'm gonna see y'all next time, y'all. Peace out.